Hi there, it's Bobby Reginelli with Modus Real Estate. I have another incredible Denver listing for you and something very close to my heart. 1668 St. Paul in Denver City Park South neighborhood. This is a vintage 1907 Denver Square. This is four beds, two baths, overflowing with charm. It's one of the most intricately detailed Denver squares that I've been inside of and absolutely love this home. There's so much to show you, so much charm, so much historic character. Come on with me, let's take a tour. At just over 2,800 square feet, this Denver Square lives large, and this is actually one of the larger Denver Squares. They made two models of these originally. They made a 20-foot wide one, and they made a 30-foot wide one. Extra room to stretch out here and enjoy all of the amenities of City Park South. You are about four houses from City Park Lake and the historic boathouse. They have the museum out there, Museum of Nature and Science. And there's just a lot to love. Tons of recreation around here. Colfax is two blocks to the south, so you get Restaurant Row and all of those features. And it's just incredible. My alma mater, East High School, is three blocks to the west. And there's just all sorts of culture and vibe that Central Denver is known for. So this home is just really incredible to share with you. We've got a large sitting room with the original hardwoods underneath this carpet. So you are going to be able to bring this back to the original flavor if that's your style. Come through here and we have a nice modernized kitchen. This is very tastefully done and has a large butler's pantry off to the side with tons of storage for everything. I love how light and bright this is. And then the mud room right here leads out to a big backyard. One point that I'd like to make is, is that this is zoned two unit. So you could build a second unit here. You're also fully able to do an accessory dwelling unit. And there's a lot of future development potential in a neighborhood that's just getting hotter. So come on upstairs and let me show you what we got going. Upstairs, you have three really generous bedrooms and this beautiful sunroom that doubles as an office. It was originally a closet. So there's so much space here for you to really stretch out. I love the historic, everything is in touch. Your original trims, your original crowns. I mean, it's just 1907 still here. All of the old brass handles. Everything's in great shape. And I love the fact that they preserve the original wood floors. Another big bedroom. They did Anderson double pane windows here. So really nice upgrade where they could, but they left a bunch of the historic leaded windows as well. You have a nice bathroom in here with a big shower and then step into the primary suite. One of the highlights here, of course, is gonna be this really luxe large closet. It's a walk-in. So they've kind of combined two original rooms into this big feel. And then you step back here and you have a nice little oasis beautiful bedroom and just really nice and easy recluse for you to relax. So let me take you downstairs and show you the accessory dwelling option where you can get some income potential. One of the coolest parts about these old houses is that they had this original door that would lead in where you could have a coal burning fire and so they could heat the house. Well, now it's a separate entrance, which gives you real flexibility for an income property or a mother-in-law suite. So come check it out. You could close this off completely from the rest of the home. Person comes down here. This is an 80 plus walk score neighborhood. Person comes down here. You got a beautiful little bed set up. Nice office here, and then a big full bath. And it's just, you know, again, this place lends itself to offsetting some of your mortgage by renting this out. Airbnbs for nightly in the neighborhood are north of 150 a night, so really quite a nice perk. And then in here, a nice little living area. You got the TV, you got the built-in shelf storage, and I mean, it's just ready to go. Throw a little Keurig, a little mini fridge, a microwave, and somebody's gonna have a very nice stay and they can walk to everything right here in City Park. So again, love to take you upstairs and finish out strong in the dining room. 
So much historic charm. I just can't get enough of this house from the push button light switches to the original baseboard, the beautiful crown molding above. It's just absolutely like I want to have tea time right here. And it's worth pointing out this large backyard here, lots of great greenery. There's a separate sitting area with a fire pit and a large two car garage. So everything's in here. It's moving ready. I really want to thank you for touring 1668 St. Paul in Denver City Park neighborhood. We're going live this weekend, and if you have any questions, reach out. This one's not going to last. Thanks again. Bobby Reginelli from Modus Real Estate.